गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास दिस इज एग्जाम्पल फोर्थ एग्जाम्पल ऑफ जोमेट्रिक मीन एक्चुअली दिस इज ऑल्सो ए प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ जोमेट्रिक मीन सो अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस प्रॉपर्टी इट इज गिवेन इफ एन वन एंड एन टू आर डी साइजेस जी वन एंड जी टू द जोमेट्रिक मीन्स ऑफ टू सीरीज रेस्पेक्टिवली द जोमेट्रिक मीन जी अफ दि कम्बाइंड सीरीज इज जो तुम लोगक सीरीज दिया थके सीज एन वन टू अबजार्भेशन आए और सेकेंड सीरीज एन टू टू अबजार्भेशन फार्ष्ट सीरीज जोमेट्रिक मीन टू जी वान सेकेंड सीरीज जोमेट्रिक मीन जी टू जो आम दूटा सीरीज कम्बाइन कर दूँ एक लग कर दूँ तहतर जेंट जोमेट्रिक मीन तो हम ये सो दिश इज दि कम्बाइंड जोमेट्रिक मीन अफ टू सीरीज उ हेव टू प्रूव इट At first, I will write the observations. I will take two series. Let x one one, x one two, dot dot dot, x one n one. With the first series, n x two one x two two dot 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 x two n two be the second series. You can see in the first series there are n one observation and in the second series there are n two observation. So now, <coughs> since it is given that the geometric mean of first series, <coughs> sorry, the geometric mean of first series is G one. So G one will be x one one into x one two. Into x1 n1 whole to the power 1 by n1. So if we take log on both sides, it will become log z1 equal to log of x11 x12 x1 n1 whole to the power 1 by n1. According to the property of log, this power will come down. It will be 1 by n1. Log of x11 into 12 to dot 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 1 n1. Since these values are multiplied and it is uh, taken as log, so according to the property of log, it will become log x11 plus log x12 plus dot 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 plus log x1 n1. So one by n one into summation of i goes from one to n one log x one i. So similarly, the geometric mean of second series will be x two one, x two two, x two n two whole to the power one by n two. If we take log on both sides of this, it will become one by n two. I have directly written this. You have to show this x two j. It will become uh, one by n two summation of j goes from one to n two log of x two j. So now, if we combine the both series. The geometric mean of the combined series will be the geometric mean of combined series, that is G. It is given in the question as G. The combined mean of the combined geometric mean of both series is given as G. So here we have to multiply the two series. N one, x two one, x two two, x two n two whole to the power one by n one plus n two. So 
so here also we have to take log on both sides if we take log on both sides this power will come down it will be 1 by n1 plus 1 by n2 I have skipped one line you can write it x11 12 1n1 x21 x2 n2 it will become and then log x21 log x22 plus log x2 n2 so in this we can we can write these terms as summation of log x1i and this term as summation of log x2j log z equal to 1 by n1 plus n2 I can write this as summation i goes from 1 to n1 log x1i and this part as j goes from 1 to n2 log of x to j So in, in place of this, in place of this summation of log x1i, that means this we can write it as n1 log g1 and in place of this summation of log x2j we can write as, we can, we can, uh, we can write as n2 into log g2 that is n2 log j2 so this is the combined geometric mean of two series so that's all for today